In the following footage, I wish to demonstrate the SWR values from the Diamond D Whiskey Delta 330S terminated folded dipole. The letter S means that it is a short length dipole. Normally, you would expect it to be about 20 meters in length, and this one is only 10 meters in length. Now, for those of us who live in a typical dwelling in the UK and suffer from dimensional constrictions, which prevents us from using horizontal antennas at a greater length of more than 10 meters, then the Diamond Whiskey Delta 330S may well be a worthy choice for consideration. I have my antenna connected to the chimney and then supported at the opposite end using a GRP pole at a height of about 7 meters. The ballon is supported centrally using a scaffold tube which is fixed to the masonry fabric of the building. The SWR values, which we'll demonstrate shortly, are transmitted on the frequencies which are associated with the transmission of digital data. However, I can assure you that these readings are constant um, within the chosen band and when it is used in the voice portion, um, the SWR is the same. The following footage indicates that the 10 meters and 12 meter bands show excessively high SWI readings and I suspect that this is purely down to the, the built environment and the way in which I have installed um, and configured the antenna. I think that the uh, I'm getting some reflective power coming back from the roof of the, of the, the dwelling. The SWI is reduced with Matuna. Um, additionally, this antenna will tune on 1.8 MHz and I have had contacts into Europe um, and around the UK using Whisper and data modes. Um, additionally, 50 MHz will also tune, however, at this moment in time, I do not have, a, have any evidence to, to uh, suggest how effective it is. Um, I hope that the following footage is uh, of use to you and... Um, it can help you to make your choice if you're thinking about choosing to purchase one of these antennas. Thank you for watching.